average piece of food in the United States travels over a thousand miles from farm to plate. Over one thousand miles from farm to plate. So here's a great opportunity for each one of us to reduce our ecological footprint, to reduce our carbon footprint, while also doing something else we all believe in, which is supporting local economies. So there's a number of ways you can do that. Obviously, the most local thing you can do is grow your own. There's a huge amount of embodied energy captured in our food. The next best thing, if you can't do that, is patronize your local farmer's markets. Farmer's markets are a great way to find out where your food is grown. You can ask the farmers questions. You can make much more informed choices when you can interact directly with a farmer and have a much more satisfying experience and keep those monies in your local community. If you are going to a grocery store, start asking questions. Where was this grown? How far did this come? A lot of times there will be product labeling. You can patronize stores that buy local. Those are a variety of ways that we can make those choices. We make those choices when we go out to eat. You can uh, patronize restaurants uh, that buy local. You make sure you give those produce managers and store managers credit and thank them. It's a movement that we're trying to build here. So grow your own, go to farmers markets whenever possible, otherwise buy local if you can, and that can have a huge advantage in terms of our collective reduction of pollution and energy.